All right, we are video, I think, 14. Uh, I'm here in Melbourne. This is Chapel Street, Vine Street behind me. I'm just about to get home after a big day at our seminar, and uh, I'm not going to have time to do a video, so I thought I'd quickly do a three-minute video log now. Uh, I'm out in front of a kebab shop and pizza shop, so um, they might ask me to buy something. But <laughs> anyway, we'll get through this video. Um, so I wanted to share with you guys, I guess my number one number one takeaway. There's so many. You know, I probably had like 45,000 lessons this weekend at the event, meeting some really cool, beautiful people, and just yeah, upgrading my mind and doing some work around um, the event as well. Actually, one really cool thing is I met this one girl at the event, and um, she just spoke some like dropped some truth bombs around entrepreneurship, around the Generation Y and millennials. Generation Y, yeah, and millennials and entrepreneurship, talking about health and wellness and mindset, everything. There's just all this cool stuff that uh, I really vibe with. So her name's Bella, and we're going to connect on Tuesday. I'm going to interview her for the YouTube channel. So stay tuned to Raw Cave. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like le lately, I've just been like chatting to people that I usually wouldn't speak to. Like just walking up to people and being like, "Hey, how are you? Like, you seem really nice. Like, can you know, may I introduce myself?" And people at the beach, you people on the street. I know it sounds like I'm a weirdo, but those who are comfortable with it, I've met some really cool people and some people that I believe I'll vibe with really well. And one of them is Bella, and then we're gonna do this interview on my YouTube channel. So uh, everyone's waiting, I think, in this world for um, everyone's waiting to meet another cool friend or someone who they vibe with, and. Uh, you know, 50% of the people like me, 50% of the people probably don't like me, maybe a more percentage don't, I don't know, but I'm cool with that. I, I'm, it's way worth just getting to know someone a little bit to see if you vibe with them and potentially making an awesome friend and not trying at all. So, you know, this whole fucking social media thing, Instagram, fucking Snapchat, Facebook, it's for me, I'd, uh, I'll, you know, this is why I'm doing this video challenge to be as authentic as possible to take off all my social masks of trying to people please and be someone that I'm not and trying to um, I guess you know portray a certain part of myself on social media this video challenge is all about just being me and sharing that on social media and I think most people maybe yourself is just over the fakeness on social media you know the filters and the fucking all that crazy shit don't get me wrong I do filter my Instagram photos I think that makes them look awesome <laughs> but um and put some quotes on them, you know, I think it's, you know, we all need a bit more inspiration every day. But, uh, you know, how can we share ourselves more authentically on social media? That's my challenge here. Is this video, three minute video thing, the best way? Maybe not, but it's at least a stab in the dark. You know, the last week I've had a bunch of people, actually not a bunch of people, some people really close to me say, what the fuck are you doing with this video challenge, dude? Like, why do you have your shirt off? Why are you talking about this stuff? Like, that's really personal stuff. And I guess they don't see the, the, the value of this video challenge. For me, I'm doing this to learn more about myself and to be uh, more authentic to the world and to social media. Because, you know, the things that I'm sharing with you guys is what I would share with my friends and close family. And some people don't share their close things on social media. And that's cool. That's just, that's just a decision they've made. They don't feel comfortable with it. But this is a challenge for me to share some things that are going on for me that I'm really... Um, new to that I'm challenged with that I'm learning and to then share that on social media to be authentic and just real and just be like as as transparent as possible sure I'm not going to share everything with you guys but um, yeah anything that I'm fearful of and or uncomfortable doing I know that that's the direction I need to head in right public speaking acting when I was um, 16, 17 years old, as a computer gamer playing 16 hours a day, World of Warcraft, the biggest goal I ever had was if I could be anything close to doing an acting gig on, on TV or on video, that was my biggest goal and inspiration. And I worked my ass off to become the person that I that was able to do that. You know, they say set a goal so big that you have to be, that you have to become the person that it, that then attracts that. You know, so I had to become the person that then was, I've been offered TV appearances and stuff like that, or being on Home and Away, for example. So, anyway, um, doing something outside of my comfort zone, becoming comfortable in those uncomfortable situations is what this is all about. 
and it's definitely challenging for some people they're just like why the fuck are you doing it if you're one of them that's totally cool you're probably not watching the video this far in <laughs> but this is the authenticity that i'm trying to portray and if you guys are out there wanting to do this video challenge just do it three minutes a day put it on a put it on a youtube account don't even put it as public just set it as private and uh, see how far you go within 10 days or 30 days of doing it and um, document the journey document the process don't try to create something new anyway that's my little lesson today it's just what's been happening for me today and um, yeah hopefully you guys are awesome it's a Monday tomorrow I'm really excited got some brand new goals and I've planned by next year so I'm gonna really get into some epic action before 2018 I'll talk to you guys later now bye bye